Okay. This video was filmed in Panama City to fill in the time gap and between clips in our video and to provide narration and a story for our, you know, trip. Anyways, chapter 22 of Jasper and Mia Sailing the World Out at Sea. because we left our anchorage and we're here in Graham's Key to do some nice snorkeling. We heard it's the best place before we start our seven day voyage to Panama, which will pretty much suck. While we were in Guanaja, we did some pretty cool stuff. We caught a few fish, which was good. We did some really good snorkeling. It was like the best snorkeling we've done since probably Cozumel, which was the beginning of our trip. So I'm glad we're getting some snorkeling in. This place is actually supposed to be the nicest, so I'd be, it would be hard to be even nicer than the last week we went to. I'm excited to see it. And while we were in Ganaha, made some friends. There's a, these guys on Piratical that were anchored beside us. They were really nice. Um, and there's this little bar there. I don't think it has a name, but it's like this little shack. And there's some really nice guys there. There's Pico, who makes his own wine, and he has his own organic farm, which is really cool. Mom and Dad really enjoyed the wine. And, yeah, he raises his own organic farm, so really good food. He's a good cook, too. And that was pretty much Guanaja. We filled up on gas and water, and now we're ready to go on our voyage. Predict wind failed us uh, pretty bad. It told us that there was going to be some pretty strong winds. So we decided, okay, let's catch these powerful winds and go. We packed up our stuff, said goodbye to some pretty nice people, some tasty food, and some okay Wi-Fi. Hey look, it's Steve. Yes, I have named him Steve. Steve the Petrel, the pointy beak. He looks like a professor from a university. Yeah. Hello, I am teaching you, I am here to teach you about the aerodynamics of flight. No offense, Steve. Second day out at sea, a, a royal turn pops up and lands on our boat. I call him a, I call him another type of bird. Can't remember what, but he's actually a royal turn. And fun fact, their heads, like more, normally they have a sort of cul-de-sac of black hair, of black feathers, but during the mating season, it grows into a full-on, like, top of black feathers. Pretty cool, right? And so the bird stayed all night. I named him Steve. And he pooped every... He pooped a lot. So, yeah, Dad had to clean that up. Dad was, uh, okay with Steve being here. He wasn't enthused. See that? Hey, it's my bow, man.
dry spout where we didn't catch any fish and we were kind of running out of protein. No. But we were running out of meat. So something finally caught the line. Turns out it was a barracuda. We said that we were too good for barracuda but since we hadn't had caught any fish recently we were going to keep it. And it like <laughs> popped off the hook and just swam away. It was very sad. And um, after that, we were all really bored. So I decided to put the boom that I'm hanging off of right now over the side of the boat and um, drag behind it in the water. That was fun. like um, jet snorkeling and I saw a lot of jellyfish. The water felt fast if you were like standing on the ladder and your feet were in it. But once you were in it, it didn't feel that fast. Dad tried swimming beside it, the boat, without holding on. Nearly, got, nearly got sucked away into the great blue. I kind of saved him with my foot. You gonna pop in with him, Dad? Jasper, don't tie it around yourself. Jasper, don't. You're not. Because it's very dangerous. Oh. Why'd you tie it around your hand and then? That's just to keep it so that rope doesn't fly out of my hand. So oh, we're hardly moving right now and everything's slapping. I'm really bored because we're just bobbing at two knots right now, which it's super slow. It literally feels like we're just bobbing from side to side. But it, it looks really beautiful, which is nice. And 
We look like totally fresh sailors with the way we set up our sail. Look, we got the boom holding it up, and it looks huge. We could be fresh. Well, we could be fresh if we could go faster. Thanks for watching. This has been chapter 22 of Jasper and Mia Sailing the World. We hope you enjoyed, and if you did, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks! Okay, Garmin, stop recording.